Hello there, I'm Alger Hill and welcome back to Stellaris Apocalypse Guardians of Paradise Gaia only in 2.0. It is 52 years into the game, which means that the mid-game thing will be happening in a little while actually, which I realise is actually a little scary because I moved the mid-game to be a tiny bit earlier. I'm a frightened little girl, must be honest. Now we're at fleet lit capacity of 80. We are researching an increase of 30, which would be good, which will allow us to buy, maybe start building another small fleet, like a small destroyer fleet that I can have on the outskirts of my empire. I love this kind of, <clears throat> like, breaking apart of fleets, when you get smaller fleets and they can all f combine together. I love this idea, because I think that's much more how an empire would be. Okay, so we're going to need to keep grabbing over here. Starbase, woo! Now it's mine. Ha <laughs> ha! You can't have it. Well, we can block them up, and then we also want to block him as well. Once we block that, we want to start blocking to the west as well. Because we're never going to get anything. Should have been racing towards the outer reaches much much sooner than before. Okay, everything's going to be alright. That. That. Once we got that, actually. There. Uh, Good. Yes, we've successfully blocked them off. Fantastic. Did it. It's all ours now. Construction complete. Okay, we want to block them off as well over here. Oh god, look at all the claims. That's what they're spending their influence on, it's claiming our systems. Well, we still managed to keep up to date with our fleet limits, so we should be fine. Should be fine. God, we have a lot of bloody minerals. And nothing to spend it on. Actually, no, we can. We can upgrade them to star holds. Why not, right? Might as well make them star fortresses. I mean, I've got the minerals. Construction complete. System survey complete. Oh, go over there. Oh, it costs so much. Oh, God. Okay, go get, get another outpost over there. Go, 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 go. Start blocking these things off. All right, we blocked that off. That's good. Um, Now let's go over here. We can start working towards blocking this off. We're starting to finally make some consistent borders. It's beautiful. Oh, my God. So happy. <laughs> okay. We have a capacity increase will be happening soon. That'll mean we can keep our, our ship fleet size ahead of everybody else. It'll be really, really good for us. What's that shit doing? Ah, damn it. Hey. If they've already grabbed this. They've already grabbed it. If I already grabbed it. Son of a bitch. Communications. Receiving transmissions for the Visari Star Empire. Hello. Okie dokie. Hegemony of Ukadil. Honored by warriors. Okay. And the Midari Star Regime. Alright. I haven't really found any fallen empires yet, actually. Unrest reduction, governing ethics, and leader lifespan. You really want to rush towards that, so let's get leader lifespan first. Damn, they got it first. That's going to be an ugly border. Ugly indeed. How revolting. On. On. It takes so long for them to come back. Uh, we give them 1200, they give us energy credits. Yeah, deal, I guess. We have so many. Research agreement for the moral democracy. Done. I'm happy to help you out, you weirdos. Alright, so that's got sent all the way back. Oh my god. You need to get over there and start... Colonizing, exploring things. Let's go. The have 
granted us new wisdom. Okay. Combat rolls. Defense grid supercomputer. Wow. Defense platform plus eight. Awesome. Um, that's gonna be useful, but later, I think. Fruit assist research plasma throw disruptors. disruptors. I think we're gonna start coming this way. I need to block all this area off. Oh, we don't want to forget the north, though. Honestly, I have so much goddamn um, thingies. Why don't I um, influence? Why aren't I just building more construction ships? Let's go. I can start to expand to the west as well. Why not? Let's go. Let's do it. Boom. We have so much influence. Let's just use it. Trying to snake our way around. Construction complete. Happening. New construction ship over here. A post over there. You. Over here. Perfect. Good. Good stuff. This way we can grab and make a relatively concise border. Okay, and you guys go automatic exploration again. Then we can bring to the northeast as well. Good. Oh, okay. Deep breaths. Complete. Keep going, boys. <laughs> Keep going. You can do it. I believe in you. Okay. One more to the north. Okay. Start getting a border. Unfortunately, we still haven't found any Gaia worlds, but... You know, keep trying. Keep trying. Maybe we'll get lucky. Who knows? They still seem very small. So we're the fact that we're spreading so much is great. I don't think the AI is very good at expanding correctly. I mean, crazy. They got a lot of star bases we can get. I'm probably gonna put it over here. Star base there or something like that. Stuff. Probably gonna want one in the Ophelia system as well. I'm definitely gonna want that in the Ophelia system. Stuff. Bases for days. More month. Oh, two more months. Damn it. It's 44. It's 45, not 44. Come on. Interesting. Who's fighting? Hegemony of Urkdal, which is the Maori caretakers. These guys against these guys. Ooh. Hegemony are definitely going to win that. They're actually equivalent in capacity, but inferior in fleet capacity, where these guys are inferior everything. They're definitely going to win. Oh, they're done. And they got pirates in their, on their borders. They're wrecked. They're so wrecked. We're about, we're about to get even stronger as well. Keep growing, boys. We can do it. Evil capacity, yes. Your last span. Habitability, meh, meh, meh. Resource, yes. Alien species procurement, sure. Oh, we're low on influence again. Construction complete. It's happening again. Research, research. Money, money, money. What is this? Who are you? Oh, Taranaki Space Whales. That's fine. We don't care about Taranaki Space Whales. Anything else happening on the surface of the planet? We have one mineral here that's not doing anything. I feel like a stronghold might be a good idea for defensive values, but we'll see. Just like this one slot that no one's using. I think we should definitely try and have an excess of food. Certainly be a good idea. Antipander resistance. Uh, do, 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 advanced shields. Yeah, let's get anti matter reactor. Modify pilot. Tragic, tragic fate. So tragic. Our base. Ooh, and there goes there's our fleet capacity up a little bit. Nice. Right. 
Let's... No, I mean, we have two fleets, so if we just put them on the opposite ends of the of our system, I think we're going to be okay. Alright, so we got one cruiser of each type, three of those. So let's get another couple of those, another couple of those. There we go. Uh, we're going to attack your class. Perfect. Go. Now upgrade to their full strength. This means we can keep the second fleet to a kind of anti-pirate kind of type of thing, and the first fleet to a more general intelligence, awesome, destruction, murder, kill thing. <laughs> that was not very helpful, I know, but it's okay. Alright, build lots of energy minerals here. Search stations. Gotta save up a little bit of influence before we grab anything else, unfortunately. As long as we can grab this, they won't be able to get past here because the alien menace is stronger than any fleet that anyone can bring just yet. So this can be abandoned for a little while. We can just push up to this section here. Then, yeah. That's it. Keep going this way. And then we can focus all our efforts to the north. And maybe building some defenses along the south too. Black cannons, armor torpedoes, building... Anti-banner missile. Our fleets are doing good. Ursul. Nice. I'm confused. Why shipyards don't seem to be building anything, yet I've asked them to upgrade. System survey complete. What's happening? Oh, they could they do they could actually have one more Corvette. Pirate sighting in the Serpa system. Again. Get them, boys! 5k fleet strength, let's go. Self modification, claim influence cost, ecological adaption. Terraform inhabited planets. Yes, we want to go this one because that can move things towards Gaia. You can move things towards Gaia world, but it'll take a really long time. Yeah, do it. Get them, boys! you get hey communications established 31 influence awesome the curators yeah we all know about the curators so cool how you doing bye Go there and get that mining to get that station boy okay we don't want to get i do we want to grab this five and no i'd really rather just get like this like a defensive station Fire station rated. Okay, so peace. Oh no. Yeah, they took so much. Oh, those are gonna be the big boys. Alright, return home. Now yeah, they didn't even take any hull damage. Good job, guys. Alright, we're gonna keep expanding our borders. Best we can, and then it's going to be focusing on the north to kind of clutch into this area, and then we'll focus on just shoring up our defenses. I don't have the influence for elections. System survey complete. You'll have a decent fleet strength. Terraforming candidate discovered. Once may have supported life in distant past, frozen water. Okay. Once restoration has been researched. Cool. But we don't want to do that just yet. <clears throat> What do you mean you can't find any more? What? Kind of random. Where'd the ruler go? What the hell? Whatever. The exile can take care of it. Oh, hello. Oh, God. A stagnant ascendancy. Oh, my God. The Fallen Empire is right here. The Havel Chronicles, the Guardians of and the Guardians of Paradise. Greetings, well met. Stayed over space or face certain doom and so forth. No excuses. We're quite busy. Oh, God. Boarding of knowledge and technology. No. Well, I guess that blocks us off, doesn't it? Shit. <laughs> okay. I guess, but I guess that's our border then. Our rather natural border. Auto cannons.
Building those star bases, guys. Well, at least we know exactly how big our empire is going to be. It's going to be a slice of this. That's it. Managed to weaken the Genoji nation, but these guys are probably going to be the big boys. They're going to beat on those around and then take on this Serenity. And they're probably going to come for us. On the shoulders of giants. Ooh. Originated from a former planet. Exciting. Yeah, don't have the stuff for that, so let's get the one over here. Grab that, and then we'll have this lovely little circle. That's fine, as long as we stop other people from taking stuff. I don't care. All I care about. I just don't want anyone else to have nice things. Oh, we met the Fallen Empire. Construction complete. How exciting. There. So do you have enough influence? We'll grab that. Construction complete. Oh, what a beautiful border we have. So happy. Good, good. Still need a lot more influence there. That's okay. This means also this section is completely covered. So actually we can just expand to here. And this is completely taken over. That's good. It does mean no Gaia Worlds. God damn it. No Gaia Worlds. We hoped, but we were wrong. Unfortunate. Oh well. System survey complete. Hope and pray, but get you anywhere. You don't need to do pretty well. Problem is, you need you need costs are still pretty high, but I think we're doing okay. We'll upgrades still to be had. Anything else we can build would increase unity. The stronghold would actually increase unity and also provide additional defensive armies and administrative upgrade. So we'll get a stronghold there. Might as well. Gives us a small unity bonus. Alright, there we go. I don't want to go any further south than this. So that's it. We've done it. We've managed to secure this section of the world. The galaxy, even. It's ours now. Can't touch it. And then, 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 then. Pretty happy about this. This is good. This is really nice. It's decent borders. Still gotta snake these up over here. And then clinch these there and here. But other than that, we're good. You really need to survey this for kind of the print. There you go. Incoming transmission. A non-aggression pact? I am happy to have a non-aggression pact, because I don't want aggression. I am a chill bro, okay? Repeat after me. Chill bro. Alright, there we go. Okay, I'm still way more powerful than everybody around me because of my massive fleet size. These guys are actually equivalent to the Xanxertocracy. But my med all my immediate neighbors are small. Oh, we made a Stone Age civilization. Oh. Boarding. Ah, a star base. Star fortress. But we'll get that later, actually. Let's get um, a bit faster. Just a reveals resource. Rathium. Probably better. It's going to be a very nice little empire we have with decent fleets, all based on one planet. All of this for one planet. It's so strange. Like, who could possibly use this much space? You know, like, what am I doing with this? This space. Don't understand. And there they are. Holy Guardians. Zapclot Watchers. Shit. Where are they? Oh god, they're just around the corner. Both the Fallen Empires are just around the goddamn corner. Celestial Throne. Wait, doesn't that mean all the worlds are Gaia worlds? No, they're Arctic worlds. Ah. Oh no, Gaia world? Gaia world! <gasps> Come to me. I must have you. You must give me your land. Must be mine. Alright, then we do this, and then we've managed to completely block them off. Brilliant. System survey complete. Nice. Okay. Definitely coming along, guys. And we're, and we're also one of the most powerful people in the entire game. If not the most powerful, thank you very much. And bam. There, to block that off. Cool. No one can grab this. Awesome. 
You just gotta go along this way, and then around, and then go there, and then that's it. Robert's your father's brother. We've got everything. Look on life forms. Awesome. This entire section will be ours. And then we'll work on building up our fleets and defending ourselves, building up our outposts. Oh no. Small number of alien mercenaries and privateers appear operating the front of the space, the Mechanos. They're exiled. Wait, what? Another one? No. Unlike the civilized star nations of the galaxy, you have no single master to lord over us, but I have been chosen to convey the message to you on behalf of all the houses. Do not impose your soft and effective ways on us. You may freely send your alien ships into the territory, but do not expect them to return. Our warriors will welcome the diversion, however. Transmit on this frequency only if you wish to offer your tribute, or if you have need of mercenaries, as well as the means to pay for them. Well, we bet the other mercenaries. Where are they? Oh, they're all the way over there. That's fine. No concern of ours. Alright, did it. Got every damn part we needed. Now we, have, now we just wait for influence. So, we're already raiding. No time for this. Okay. But if I have a number of free leader slots, it's greater than zero, so we need to get higher leader slots if I want to be able to hire one of their really awesome admirals. We can also hire their fleets later, which is going to be very cool. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Here. Cool. Swarmer missiles. The non-believers are fighting amongst them. Taiken, United Nations, and the Autocracy of Buhar. The North, right? Yep. Okay, cool. That's awesome for us. And I don't have to deal with them. It's spreading to the East. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Awesome. Advanced reactor boosters, iron disruptors, hyperdrive, hyperdrive thingies, yeah. All right, that'll be it for this episode. We've expanded really, really well. We found some, found, managed to make definitive borders. There is a little bit of border gore, but we're gonna figure it out. We built we built really big fleets. We're gonna decide where we're gonna put our star bases later on based on our borders. Make sure to check out all the other series I have on my channel. Do leave me a like and a comment on the video. Let me know what you think of the series so far. It helps out a lot. And of course, check out my Patreon if you want to support me further. And there's governing ethics shift on the Confederacy of Chorus. I don't care about that. I was Algernon Lockington. This has been Stellaris Apocalypse 2.0. Bye bye.